Mm. All right, we text, we drive, but you know what? Don't judge your teenagers because we are actually the worst offenders. A new study found 49% of adults say that they text and drive compared to 43% of our teens. And Paula was just saying the fact is we're admitting it. <laughs> That's what we're doing. You know, kids may not admit it as much as we do, but Mike, you actually talked to teens about this. Yeah, I had a chance to go to Grady High School in Atlanta. We talked about a bunch of things. Kids were great, but one thing about the texting that was interesting. Yeah, they're texting and driving. Let's face it, we're setting a crappy example for our kids on that front. <laughs> yeah, it's true. But beyond true. that, listen to what this kid said about mom and dad being on whatever device. And you know what's missing? Relationship yeah. and all that. Listen to this. Wow. So like every time I get in the car, my dad is on the phone or on Facebook on his phone. And then I get in the car and I'll be like, can you get off the phone so I can tell you what happened today? Or he'll be sitting there playing a game on his phone and I'll be like, hey, dad, I need to ask you something. It'll take like three or four tries to, you know, get him like all out of his zone. Oh boy. Oh. That's deeper. I mean, yes, the safety actually front. Kind of sad. Yeah, that's deeper. Let me share this story and we'll, and we'll go off and running here. I was at a barbecue joint and it was a, clearly a daddy daughter day. And I looked over and there's dad and there's a, probably a four year old little girl and she's kind of fumbling around with the crayon. What's dad doing? Oh, no. And I just wanted to go over to him and just say, Dad, you're going to miss it. Yeah. You're going to turn yeah. around. You're going to miss everything. And thank God. This was not around when my guys were little. That actually makes me want to cry. Well, that's what can happen, though. But yeah. wait a minute. I'm feeling totally convicted. That happened to me like last week. I was sitting on the couch, and my son said to me, all you do is stay on your phone. You know what? Wake up, call. Like, yeah. Yeah. Wake up, call. Yeah. 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 The up bells were ringing. Okay. Well, well that's where you the conversation of should our kids even have phones, you know, at a right. young age. Let's put our phones aside for a second. Mm -hmm. Christy, your daughter, actually, <laughs> your little girl writes you a letter trying to negotiate with you <laughs> now, on her, why, you should, why she should have a cell phone. She's turning nine, and in her defense, this was a school thing that she had to write for us for a conference. And Pete and I were reading this going, are you kidding? kidding me? Go ahead and listen to her. This is, this is my daughter, Ava. Have you realized that I'm old enough for a phone? I'm responsible. There are great apps on a phone, such as educational games. I would have it for school projects. So I would like to give you reasons why I want a phone. It is easy to see why I need a phone. However, did you think I would need one in an emergency? If I was in an emergency and you weren't there, I would need a phone. I would call 911 or you. Think about what I said and please make the right choice. Wow. Please make the right wow. choice. <laughs> Listen, I was most impressed with the fact that this girl knows how to negotiate because yes. I don't know where the hell she got that from. <laughs> but she's nine and I am in so much trouble. And yes, she, you by are. the way, I love you, Ava, but you're not getting a phone. <laughs> oh, oh, the not judge, yet. the gavel comes not down. Not yet. There. And you know what? She's the kind of kid she'll go, okay. Oh. She won't keep trying. She won't keep lobbying. No, that's Let so me tell you something. That's my middle one. I think she's a little bit smarter than you and your husband. Believe me, we're well, well Wait, wait till she better. starts dating. That's going to be a whole... I'm other. <laughs> she's sharp.